I present to you our secret lab. Lucius, you have seriously outdone yourself this time. <laughs> Glad you like it. Like it? Oh, no, this... This changes everything. It was getting a bit dodgy hiding all those Batarangs in the Wayne Enterprise R&D wing. Thank you, Lucius. Come on. Now the real work starts. Hmm. Somehow I was expecting more. Where's the giant crater? I thought this was where your friend went out with a bang. That was his office upstairs. Better question. Where's the phalanx key? It should be in the vault. Well, what you waiting for, sweetie? Go get it. Protocol vault thumbprint required Lucius Fox. That's not right. Why the lockout? Someone's been in here. What's taking so long, Bruce? It's saying it won't open without Lucius's thumbprint. And that got blown up with the rest of him, didn't it? Oh, all the dumb luck. You're saying we can't get it open then? Harley's not going to like that at all. Or you. L let me try to find latent prints around here with my scanner. Always thinking, this guy! Dinner to celebrate Tiffany's first day at Wayne Enterprises. I'm sorry you didn't make it there, Lucius. All right, that's a start. Getting there. Okay, still unconscious. Hope he's not hurt too badly. should do it. Just a bunch of old reports. Need to remember to clean out some of this junk. Not a single usable print. sure if it works. It's an EMP generator, Puddin. <laughs> Tell him what it does. It emits a pulse that knocks out other nearby electronic devices. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to try that? Now, still. 
still finding ways to help me. Stay there. Don't touch anything. I touch what I want when I want, Brucey boy. You knew what's best for you. You'd quit giving orders and find me that key. Looking for this. Tiffany. I told you I'd find out what you got my dad mixed up in. This, this is much worse than I thought. You're not safe here. You have to hide. What the hell are you doing with a secret room full of weapons? What's going on here, Bruce? What's all this for? Your father worked with Batman. That's who all this stuff is for. Batman. I know it! His tech! Dad's fingerprints are all over it. I came looking for answers, but... I didn't expect this. Bruce. These people you're with. I saw on the cameras what they did to that guard. To Regina. They'll do the same to you, or worse. Get out of sight. Bruce! What's taking so long in here, huh? Hey, I know you. We met at your father's funeral. John. Okay, Bruce. No need to get physical. I get it. We'll be as quiet as lab rats. But, but what about Harley? I mean, she's gonna want to know about your uh, friend here. What am I supposed to tell her? Keep your mouth shut, John, or I promise you you'll regret it. <laughs> I can tell this means a lot to you, Bruce. You're using your stern father voice. I like it. You heard him. Shut it. <laughs> You got it. I don't like lying to Harley, but I'll do it for you, Bruce. What I really need is the phalanx key. You give me that, I can go out there and, you know, make Harley happy. You can have the key. Just leave Tiffany out of it, okay? You mean this thing? That's it? <laughs> You've got to be kidding, Bruce. You can't give these psychos anything from this lab. Hey now, no need to get personal. We're all on the same side, remember? Come on, Bruce. You know how dangerous this tech could be in the wrong hands. Yoo-hoo! What the hell is going on in there? I don't like it any more than you do, Tiffany. But this is the only way to walk away safely. Trust me, it's the right thing to do. It's a little too late for that. Tiffany! Well, how about that? Looks like Brucey boy's got more than just technology in his vault. Keeps his little squeezes down here, too. Just let her go, Harley. I don't think I will. Not without knowing who this vicious little sweetie pie is. I kinda like her, but I don't know whether to smooch her or smash her head in. You gonna tell me who she is to you? Or am I gonna have to find out the hard way? We grew up together. You could say she's family. You know family of mine. Oof, Bruce. Your friend seems a little hot under the collar. <coughs> she certainly has your fire, Bruce. Or should I say your spark? You people killed my dad, didn't you? He crashed my father's funeral. And now you're here raiding his lab! I whacked a bunch of people in my time, sugar. But I don't think your old man's on my list. Then again, I sometimes lose track of the name. I can't believe you'd associate with these... with these maniacs! These killers! Oh, sweetheart. Mr. Suit and Tie ain't just an associate. He's a bad, bad man. He wants to be one of us. <laughs> Ain't that right, Lucy? Came to us because you got bored of being a billionaire. Now you want to be part of the family, don't you? At least that's what you've been saying. I'm nothing like you, Harley. I'm not a murderer. That's not what I wanted to hear.
let her go. It wasn't about her. It was about seeing where he stands. But go easy on him, Harley. Bruce is loyal. He got us the key. He found it in the vault. Right on the counter. Hmm. Is that a fact? Maybe we don't need to kill ya. At least not yet. Hmm. It don't look like nothing special. You got what you wanted. Now let's just get out of here. <laughs> Load that thing up too, John. I need it. Hurry it up. Bruce! Are you all right? I'm fine, Alfred. I was keeping an eye on you over the security feed. Well, breaking into my own company was... unexpected. My heart stopped when I saw that mad woman coming at Tiffany. I was certain she was going to kill her. That young woman is smarter than both of us, Bruce. It's only a matter of time before she puts the rest of the pieces together. I heard you reveal that Lucius worked with Batman. But will that satisfy her? You know what she's like. She won't stop digging until she gets to the truth. Maybe we should just... tell her. I've always regretted not being more honest with you about your father's life. Don't stay guided. She shouldn't be left guessing. Alfred, this is hard enough without a lecture. Oh, I'm sorry if you feel this is a lecture. I'll keep my thoughts to myself. Uh, with regards to tonight's other catastrophes, your night watchman got a nasty lump on the head, but don't worry. He'll be fine. I've already arranged for him to get a generous payout and an extended vacation and replace tonight's offending security camera feed with dummy footage. I yeah, thank you. As for Regina, I'm afraid your fashion consultant's cover story is going to cause more problems. She seemed to be thoroughly unsettled after your encounter. Well, after what went on, it'll be a challenge to smooth things over with her. It's all coming so fast, one thing after another. You need to take it easy, Al. Get some rest. It's only a momentary bit of exhaustion. I, I'm sure it will pass. Bruce. I know we agreed there was no better way to get to Bane. But this whole adventure with John and Harley... Well, frankly, it's exhausting. Well, be careful, and good luck. How long does this usually take? It takes as long as it takes. You don't just call him like a dog. There's a million more efficient ways of contacting him, but you do it like this? Symbols are important. Just like principles. This is a waste of my time. You two are acting almost friendly. It's a strange sight. Batman? About time. Gordon, you're dismissed. This is still my goddamn station house. He's forgetting I'm the one who can make or break his career right now. You only remind me every other minute. Clearly, I need a better method of getting the message across. You're both behaving like children. Watch your tone, Batman. Or what? You'll put him on timeout? I've been lenient with you so far, but don't push me. She's got some kind of leverage on you, doesn't she? If she's jammed you up somehow, just say the word. I'll appeal.
appeal to the mayor, the governor, whatever it takes to get her off your back. I I'll do whatever I can to help you. She knows who I am, Jim. Oh, yeah? Well, so do I. You're Batman. That's all you ever have to be. That's all Gotham needs you to be. And you, if you're threatening to take that away, you should be ashamed of yourself. I don't want to hear it. Just supposed to come to Gotham, put the chains on Riddler and his gang, and get the hell out. I'm just saying, this city gets under your skin. Fast. Know what I mean? Best laid plans and all that. You didn't choose this profession because it's easy. You do the job, or you don't. You're absolutely right. I guess you locals see it differently. Agent of Esther. She fought to get on this assignment, you know? Wanted to see her old neighborhood, wanted to see you, her hometown hero. She wanted to impress you. She admires what you do for the people of the city. Your respect is important to her. Does she know who I really am? Who do you think told me who you are? <laughs> for the world's greatest detective, you sure can be slow. My lab techs were able to replicate a dose of the venom serum from the vial Bane left behind at the police arsenal. But with a twist, it's actually a counter-agent. After a brief rush, it'll flush the venom from his system, leaving him weak and exhausted. Could be useful. So, Wayne Enterprises. Heard you made some new friends. You're having me followed. Thanks to you, these very bad people have an EMP and a key that'll open every lock I would want to keep bolted shut. They're clearly planning something. Mistakes are too high to leave anything to chance. You know, I actually considered asking you to infiltrate Riddler's gang. Before everything blew up, I knew I could count on you to get me close to them. Close to Bane. You're good at this. Seems like you've already won Harley Quinn's trust. Putting a tail on me jeopardizes the mission. Call it off. You're right. I will. Get them away from their base of operations. Somewhere, they'll be exposed. When they're all together, out in the open, contact me. I'll be standing by, ready to ambush. We'll take them down when they're at their most vulnerable. Sound good? They'll never know what hit them. You need to involve Gordon. Don't tell me how to run my operation. His people know this city better than anyone. And they have their hands filled with other priorities right now. Batman. If it gets bad for you, just remember. We're out here. When you're in deep like this, you need friends. Let's say everything goes pear-shaped, and you get stuck in there longer than you'd like. Then what's right, what's wrong, it all gets blurry. And guess what? That's okay. Because you're going to have to do some blurry things that you are not proud of before this is done. You hear me? That's just how these kinds of operations go down. I created Batman to strike fear into criminals, not become one. Batman's not the one rubbing shoulders with them at the moment. You should think about which one Gotham really needs right now. Al, I'm in. Just don't stay embedded any longer than necessary. I'll be in and out, Alfred. Just long enough to figure out their plans. Good luck, Bruce. Stay safe. <laughs>